Yes, hello, this is Dr. Gomez speaking uh, from Valencia, Spain. <coughs> this um, small introduction to bleaching is meant to be an information for our international patients um, who want to bleach at home. So this is what they have to do at home and what they, sh what they should uh, avoid at home, okay? Well, basically we have two different options to bleach your teeth at home so you can take home either uh, a day white for example day white is uh, hydrogen peroxide in 9.5, 7.5, 14% 5, and um, you can have also night white, night white is uh, carbamate peroxide 16%, um, 10% or 22% um, the difference, just for you to know, is that hydrogen peroxide is stronger than carbamate peroxide. So hydrogen peroxide, although these percentages are lower, it's three times stronger. Okay, so this day white or any hydrogen peroxide to take home is applied twice a day, 15 to 30 minutes in your trays. The night white, so the carbamate peroxide, is applied the whole hour, the whole night. Or if you don't want to wear it at night, you should wear it minimum two hours, better four to six hours per day. So here's what you have to do. First, you brush your teeth and if you can, you use also dental floss to clean the interdental spaces. Before you put in the tray the night white or the day white. Okay, it's a very small amount. It's in your instructions how big you should put it in. Anyhow, the first application is in our, in our office, so we show you. Then you put in the trays in the upper and the lower jaw and you get rid of the excesses that come out of the tray. Okay, this here does not mean you should brush again. Then you sleep with it or if it's day white you wear it twice a day, 15 to 30 minutes. If it's night white and you want to wear it at day, you should wear it minimum two hours. After this time you take it out of your mouth, step six, and step seven you brush again your teeth and you clean the trays under current water. Okay, this is what you're going to do every day during about two weeks. And this here is what you have to avoid during these two weeks plus one day. So no side tricks, not eaten and not drunk, no um, red wine, white wine you could use, no um, Cokes, PepsiCo, Coca-Cola, whatever, um, everything that could stain your teeth is not good for that moment. No coffee, no black tea, um, and coffee means also milk coffee, cappuccino, frappuccino, mochaccino, every other chino, um, avoid that. Then um, the vinegar, the balsamic vinegar of Modena, you should avoid that. You should avoid to um, smoke, a pipe, um, uh, cigars, cigarettes, whatever. No, no chocolate, not drunk and not eaten. So Nesquik or something like that, which is also chocolate, should be avoided too. White chocolate you could use. Then no um, ketchup, no mustard, no curry, and no soy sauce. Okay. Try to avoid all these things during two weeks of bleaching plus one day and then you help us to achieve the maximum of your bleachings. I hope this has helped. Uh, if you have some questions, here is my email info at sonrisabonita.com or if you don't uh, know what it means in Spanish, it's info at smilevalencia.com also. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.